What's up y'all? Today I'm going to be watching Jigsaw for the first time. After the 1 through 7 marathon, y'all told me not to sleep on Jigsaw even though it's not in that 1 through 7 storyline. I see there's a big gap between Jigsaw and Saw 7, so I think this is kind of like the new age Saw, and I do see that Tobin Bell returns, so that's a big plus for the movie for me. But I'm just happy to be watching another Saw movie with you guys. If you want to watch the full reactions, check out the Patreon in the description down below. There's a 7-day free trial right now which gives you access to all of the previous full-length reactions. But let's just go ahead and get right into part eight, Jigsaw. This music. Oh, tire spikes. Starting off with some action. Got a little chase sequence. Okay. Damn, who the hell is driving this car? He's hauling ass. Hey, what an intro. Good lord, what an intro. X marks the spot. Freeze! Stop right there! Put down the weapon! Can't stop it now! Detective Hall! He's not here! It's 17 minutes! Five people are gonna die! Edgar, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> yeah, what the anymore? fuck you doing, man? What's that for? Games are just getting started. What game? I gotta choose who dies. Them or me. Edgar. I don't wanna shoot you, but I will. Target the remote. If he moves to trigger it, blow it to shit. I'm not fucking dying. Oh, blow his fucking hand off. God damn. He just kicked off a game? He said five people would die. Which one of you assholes shot him in the chest? Damn, someone shot him in the chest? It started. Whoa, it started. Saw. A jigsaw. <laughs> All right. Okay. And we're kicking right off into like the main game, it looks like. So, jigsaw is fast paced as hell. I'm all about that. Wearing buckets on their heads. Please help me. Please, the Please help me. I'm in the same shit. I'm two year old wondering why you're here. Salvation can be yours. If you cleanse yourselves of the habitual lies which have brought you here. All these fools are liars? I want to play a game. Yeah. An offering of blood. No matter how little it will give you a green light. The choice is yours. Choice is ours. Okay, so they just have to spill some blood? Uh, there's a lot of souls on that wall. How much blood are we talking here? Are we talking I can do like a little finger prick? We talking? I have to chop off the hand. Damn, there's, this dude's fucking knocked out. He didn't wake up, man. <laughs> that dude's just dead on arrival. No matter how little. Okay, see, I do a little finger prick. Why would you do the forearm? You're insane. But hey, see, and she's proof of concept. As soon as I saw that, getting the blood. Hey, smart. You went too slow though, dude! <laughs> you got fucking yanked in! See, there you go. Hell, that, that woman's getting drugged! Come on! Oh my god, did that nerd just shred her fucking back? And this dude's just now waking up? Damn! On to the next. Dang, the chains are still going. Holy God, this movie is moving so fast. Oh, did he just get shredded? I dig a farm uh, setting for a Saw movie. It sounds interesting. Everyone always yells out help in these damn Saw games. I wish I was that athletic. Riding a bike to the park to then run. Someone just fucking dangling over there? Underhand. Once again with the uh, the public display of Jigsaw. 
Is that a fucking laser? Can you actually... Is that real? Oh my god. Half his fucking head is gone. What trap was he in? Is that what would happen with the bucket? Someone's been studying up on John Kramer. Copycat? Hope not. Kramer's been dead for 10 years. So, okay, 10 years after Saw 3. Ooh. The hell is that? Is that a chip? And then there were four. The games have begun again, and they will not stop until the sins against the innocent are atoned for. Billy! Billy have glowing eyes? Damn, Billy done got an upgrade in Jigsaw. Yeah, what the fuck? He looks way creepier with the red glowing eyes. Damn. Confess. Billy's out here trying to get him to confess. No, it's not creepy at all. Hey, nah, Billy ain't creepy. Billy's always giving you the, the way to salvation. Now his life's a little creepy. <laughs> oh, we're starting another game. All it said was simply confess. Hey, she's pretty smart for trying to wrap it around the base over there. Oh! Yeah, that's razor wire, though. Man, we all have something to confess. I, I stole a kid a bike once. He had an accident ten minutes after I sold it to him. It's not my fault he couldn't handle such a powerful damn bike, all right? He died! That's it. That's all you did. You sold a kid a bike. Yeah, and died. Yeah. Oh, come on, man. That's it. That's it. I said that's it, man. Yeah, bullshit. What about you, sweetheart? Yeah, you just sold a bike. Now you're in a saw game? I don't think so. Yeah. Obviously, y'all are hiding some shit. <laughs> Facts. Facts. Play me. Ooh, better grab that tape from Billy. Play the damn tape, Mitch. What's these numbers? Unless you turn that finger inward, I assure you, more blood will be lost, and all will be judged. You tell him, John. One who is not only a liar, but a thief, a purse snatcher. And when you have a chance to fix the harm that you've done, you chose to do nothing. Wait, what? Now it is you who could die without the right medication. While unconscious, Stole a woman's purse and had her die because she didn't have her inhaler? One of the syringes in front of you holds the antidote. One is a saline solution. The other, an acid that will cause an excruciating death. Inject the correct oh, damn! and your chains will be released. Failure to make the right choice could result in death for you all. What is a life worth to you? And go. You just gotta pick a needle, Blondie. Oh, we get out of these things when you pick an antidote. Or else we all die, Carly. No, no. What if it's the acid? I, I won't. Bullshit, you won't. That's the game. You got to. Carly, okay, did you steal purses? Yeah, years ago, but I, I, I didn't kill anyone. Somebody died, but I, it wasn't my fault. Uh, based on that flashback, it looked like it was your fault. Choose now. What do the numbers mean? Three dollars and fifty three cents. What? What does that mean? Life is worth to me. What? No way. No fucking way she just robbed her for three fifty five. <laughs> Come on, it's getting intense! I would choose the three fifty five! If somehow Jigsaw knew the 355 was the one, or that I that I stole, then I would choose that one probably. I don't fucking know, cause what's the other numbers mean? He's Wolverine clawing it. Hey, I got my Wolverine shirt on. Oh. 
Oh my god, he put all three? Oh, it's coming out of her eyes. Damn, no matter what, she's fucking dead. Oh my god, what's going on? Okay. For acid, that wasn't as horrific as I thought it was going to be. I'm not the one who put us here. Get a hold of yourself. True. I just saved our lives. We're already down to three people. Let's put numbers on the inside of this. Could be the combination. The partial decapitation was made by a circular saw. The traces of ferric oxide, hematite. Rust from blades. Okay. Rust. What about the voice recording? Anything else with flash drive? Voice was John Kramer. Matched. Confirmed John Kramer. Matched. What? You came back from the dead? Wouldn't be his first time. Because someone is dead doesn't mean they can't have a voice. On the route, Edgar Monson was spouting off about starting a game. The recording says there are four more potential victims. Four people fighting for their lives. Is that dude supposed to be the guy that was asleep? Kind of confused. <laughs> okay, we're in the countryside somewhere. I, I can't make out any landmarks. Nothing. Who's doing this to us? Do y'all not know about Jigsaw? What's your story, Lollipop? It was my husband's fault. Oh, come on, bullshit. What? Why am I being punished for something that he did? Huh? He wouldn't have rolled over and suffocated our baby. It's not my fault. Husband fucking killed the baby by rolling over on it? I don't see why that would make her be in these games. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, oh my god, exactly. Ryan, you might be getting the Dr. Gordon treatment, my friend, but way more painful potentially. There's some kind of handle. Damn. There's a tape. Ooh. Hey, at least you kind of have jeans blocking it. I don't know if that actually does anything. How much tighter is it gonna get? You guys aren't helping! Grab the tape! No, you gotta fucking grab the tape. I saved your fucking life, bitch! Grab the tape! <laughs> Quick! Oh, Out! Okay. Quick! Pull the handle and you will be set free. Simple as that! This was on the body. And then there were no three. Look, no Looks like acid. Oh! Seeing inside the body. Nice little peekaboo there. So, how long? I'm confused. Look. Because here. it's. <laughs> it was nighttime. It, it was nighttime when they party. found her, and in the game, I think it's still daytime. Dude looked out the window a while ago, so this obviously has to be jumping from some kind of time point. Puzzle piece. Jake fucking saw. Jake fucking saw, baby. This is fucked up. <laughs> is someone just sitting there waiting for them to confess? What have they done that's so horrible that they can't just confess it? I feel like when your life's on the line in these fucked up games, I'd be like, yeah, I fucking, I took the Snickers bar from the fucking 7-Eleven, man. I'm sorry. No. Then close the door on them. Fuck. No. Dang. You know when Billy's turning his head, it's some real shit. With the light, uh, the eyes lighting up. You cannot escape the truth. There is, however, one person who can help you. Ryan. If he pulls the lever before <laughs> Slow the reaction. Power, Ryan, free yourself to free them. Jigsaw's done up the bu budget, though. Look, he's got a mounted flat screen TV up in the whatever that is. Got Billy showing up in HD out here. How'd you find Eleanor? My sister? Logan, you ever heard about a website called Jigsaw Rules? 
Took some digging, but it's a site devoted to Jigsaw. Jigsaw Rules website? <laughs> we did a dark net IP troll. Got a lot of hits from your assistant. She's a regular. So you're saying that Eleanor Bonneville is our copycat? No, nah, that's not what we're saying. You check her alibi? Then what are you fucking that's saying? The that's the lab. Results are in. Whose blood is it? John Kramer. What? Who just has, like, blood on standby for Jigsaw? I refuse to believe he's back alive. Like, obviously that's gonna be some bullshit at the end of this movie. I'm liking the traps in this one, but I don't know if I'm liking the, uh, the cop and forensic team stuff. Hey, it stopped! We're fine! <laughs> Ryan's face just... Oh my god, it's like fucking sharp object roulette. Oh, got him in the shoulder. Okay, I thought they were just gonna suffocate in that thing, but I guess not. Just go, man. I know, man, just go. Perfectly in her arm. <laughs> what? Ooh. Like when you're ripping a bandaid off, you just don't think about it, you just do it. My God! It didn't just <laughs> his reaction. It didn't just chop it off at the knee. It did a little freaking like <laughs> sausage salami thing. Cut him into little pieces. <laughs> Dang! She's getting real close to these sharp, sharp objects to the face. The GPS Dang! It, okay, shout out to Ryan. He did chop his leg off. Turn your phone off. And yet here you are. You found me. You're watching my house. Because he thinks you're all about his shit. You really love that guy, huh? A predator by the name of Alistair Schultz. Alan roughed him up while he was in custody. The lawyer used that to get him off. The very next day, he kills an eight-year-old girl who shows up on my table. The first of many. You can't make it personal. When you have a little girl one day. That is what Jigsaw told Hoffman. I think it was in Saw 5. So it can't be personal. It can never be personal. Because you would have told me to take it. Yes, yes, you're damn right. I was. It's complicated. We are past complicated. I was at my uh, studio. What studio? What the hell are you talking Why about? You tell them that. You know about the Jigsaw fan website, whatever the fuck you're doing on that. You're gonna find out about everything. Show me. What the fuck is she doing? That's Strom's trap? Was that Carrie's trap? Eleanor? And that music's going crazy. Yeah, Eleanor, what the Here's fuck? This. The pistol from Saw 2? Your hobby collecting past Saw traps? Damn, she's even got the reverse bear trap. Is that the one that killed Jill? It's beautiful, isn't it? I don't know if I'd feel comfortable working with her anymore. John Kramer designed this trap for a game that took place before all the others. I built it myself. Got them from some guy on the internet. Yeah, something ain't right, y'all. What are you doing with this stuff? Yeah, that makes y'all look like shit. <laughs> and uh, I, I don't know the dude's name, but the fact that, that that dude isn't instantly calling the police, like, yeah, not only is she going to that website all the time, but she as every fucking trap. Now someone's here murdering this dude. <laughs> He's screaming his ass off. Yeah, that looked like it would hurt. You got some scars on your back, man. What the fuck is going on here? The commissioner wants to see Jigsaw's remains. He wants proof he's really dead. So he wants to calm the people's fears. Are you serious? Chasing a dead man. This Jigsaw was in a, a morgue, did a that full autopsy. Lieutenant Logan. Lieutenant? Oh, fucking X marks the spot as always. What, no Billy for this one? Come on, man. Mitch. Oh 
couldn't hold on to that. You've admitted to selling a boy a motorcycle, but you've not told the entire story, have you? Six hundred dollars for a bike that you listed in excellent condition, even though you knew the brakes were faulty. You took his six hundred bucks, and in return, you delivered him to his end. Oh my God! He was my nephew, and he never hurt anyone. The device you see here. You killed Jigsaw's nephew? <laughs> what? However, I assure you, the brake lever for this one works perfectly. Avoid the danger. You sold a bike with no brakes for 600 bucks? Fucking asshole. Oh shit! Live or die, Mitch. The choice is yours. How much does it cost to even fucking fix the brakes on a bike? It can't be that much. And here's this trap they were just saying has never been used. Low key, I was Team Mitch for a little minute. Selling a bike with no brakes, you you should have known he was gonna die immediately after leaving. This trap seems insane. Is that like razor sharp? Is he just gonna be you know shredded? It's gonna have to cut him in a second. Ooh, ooh. That was low-key pretty fucking smart. Okay, grab the brake. No, you have to grab the brake. You're a fucking idiot. Oh my god. <laughs> what? It shredded him up so fast. <laughs> Wakes up. To see brutalized Mitch. Just pulling Kramer's casket out now. What if he's not in there though? You may want to rethink that. Damn, they put the other dude in there? Call off the hunt for Edgar Munson. Come on. What? And the jigsaw piece missing? How much manpower would it take to replace the body? In John Kramer's casket. Where's John's body? <laughs> what? Is that Mitch? And then there were two. You and Eleanor in your warehouse of torture devices. Wait, you were there? Yeah, I was there. I just saw a third body. It looks like it's been through a meat grinder. All right, someone is trying to frame us. I want to right, in the studio, Eleanor I can explain. Too. You just have Do to you trust. Know he is or not, Keith. I'll tell you everything I know. Who found the body at Eleanor's studio? Jesus! Eleanor? You had motive. Who ordered the, the targeting of the remote? If he moves to trigger it, blow it to shit. Go on. Yeah, everybody targeted the trigger, but did anyone actually see what Halloran was aiming at? He had no plan to let Edgar walk. Did Halloran really shoot Edgar in the chest? Look, I don't know how to prove Halloran's the cop. It's Halloran. It's him. Let me open up Edgar Munson. We match that slug to Halloran's gun. Did they never fucking pull the bullet out of him while he was in the hospital? 19 Parabellum. That's a Glock 17. I've been trying to call you. I don't know how, how that body... No, no, no. It, it's okay. They don't think it's you or me. They're the sights set on Halloran. I found it. You found I what? I know where the game is being played. I found the farm. Oh yeah, the most recognizable car you could drive around as you follow them, you freaking weirdo. Damn, she actually escaping? Someone's out here pig masking it! Is that you fucking Gordon? Now it's got the damn ankle locket on. People having to saw through their legs all through this franchise. Other legs locked up. Damn, Ryan! <laughs> John? <laughs> what? Hello, Anna. John. It's fucking Jigsaw. What the fuck? Okay. He's got the soul patch. You're about to play a game. Damn, John's front and center right here. See, okay. This has to be the past. I already passed your test. Look at my fucking leg! That wasn't your test, Ryan. 
It wasn't your test, dog. I wish I could pause this. You who's responsible not for one death, but for three. What? Oh, damn. <laughs> 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 Fucking cars exploded. <laughs> <laughs> he fucking killed his friends accidentally. But the cars explode on impact? I don't know why that always makes me laugh. Flashback to Final Destination 2. Were it not for a careless mistake by a resident at the hospital I was in, my cancer could have been diagnosed a lot sooner. It was simply the wrong name on an x-ray. Would have saved me all. Whole lot of hardship. What? And you, Anna. They mixed up his name. They could have fucking saved John. They you fucked up me. with just two stickers. Why are you putting up shit at the same time anyway? We were neighbors, Anna and I. If only he hadn't fallen asleep that night, then he wouldn't have rolled over and uh, suffocated your baby. That is what happened, right, Anna? What does John know? This just got really fucking dark and fucked up out of nowhere. How oh, horrible to have to live with such a thing. She killed her own baby? And blamed this dude? Could make a person go mad, couldn't it? And then he fucking killed himself? <laughs> oh my god! What are you gonna do to us? <laughs> She's a psychopath. Hey, she deserves being in the fucking games. At least Ryan's was low-key an accident. Now, I'm calling bullshit on Jigsaw being alive. So, it's really just a matter of what the fuck is really going on. We're at Halloran's house, but he's not here. You got a location on him? Searching. Sir? You're just now checking the freezer. Okay, we need to bring him in. Now! To turn it all around. <laughs> fuck. Shotgun. Sawed off shotgun. Use your key to freedom. Damn, one shell. Game over. I low key want Ryan to live over Anna after what I just learned of her backstory. The bullet matches, he's connected to all the victims. He's right behind you, drop it. Drop it! Both of you! No! Alright, you got one. Oh yeah! Run! There you go, Logan! No! This is Lieutenant, dog! He's been serving time in the military. He knows what's going down. Damn, getting hit by a wrench though. That'll put anybody down. No. No, 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 don't touch that, you psycho bitch. <laughs> My only key to freedom is to kill you. Damn, she took a fucking knee on everything. Backwards. He, he said we better backwards! Just backfired on her, killed her instead? Hey, good! Good! I hated her! Ooh! Ryan was low key trying to save her for a second there. The key to freedom? <laughs> no way! Damn, there were two keys in there. They literally could have just saved each other. Jigsaw at it again with his wordplay. Oh my god. Here's your key to freedom. Here's your key to freedom. Your son's in a safe place from Saw 2? Damn, can he not even use it now? He can't even use it now, can he? Okay, so is she actually... She's out here... Pig masking it, gotta be. The hell is that? Hallor. Ah! Yell for help never works. What? These are goddamn laser cutters. What? Wait, 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 wait. Laser cutters. 
Congratulations. You found it. You are the final two players. These laser cutters slice through tissue and bone like butter. Butter. Powerful blade on the planet. All you need to do is confess. What do they have to confess to? He's a crooked cop. I will be listening. Make your choice. Oh, first. Damn, you got balls to go first. Fucking asshole. Oh fuck this dude! Right, John Kramer, it was me. It was me. I fucked up. I messed up your X-rays. Logan messed up the X-ray. You're the reason John died in the first place, you bastard. I just fucking killed him anyway. He admitted. Now you gotta confess, son. Okay. Confess! I tampered with evidence. I, I I took bribes. I put innocent people away. Put innocent people away, you bastard. Murderers and rapists what? Innocent people died because of me. I did it. Look how happy he is. Son of a bitch. There's no burn marks on the ceiling. Wait, this dude? He's not dead? Hey. What? What? His laser's just like laser pointers? What are you... <laughs> what? With blood squibs and everything, that was all just a show? Logan, you... Why? What about Eleanor? You... Is this dude Where fucking pig masking it? I am. I'm with a little help from you. No one will ever suspect it. People died because of me! Innocent people died because of me! I did it! Caught him on the tape! Ten years ago in this very barn. Oh my god. A game was played. Confirmed! Okay, so this was ten years ago. Supposedly, John Kramer designed this for a game that took place before all the others. Took place for all the others, so this was his first game. The bodies were never found. Know this because I was one of the players. Jigsaw put me in that game it was 10 years ago. I mixed up his x ray. He was sleepy, Buckethead. Oh, that's how he got the scars on his back. How's he get out? decided I shouldn't have to die over an honest mistake. He gave me a second chance. John decided he didn't deserve to die over an honest mistake? I wanted my game to be identical to Jigsaw's. So I went through your cases, found players just like the ones in the original game. I gave them the same choices that Jigsaw did a decade ago. <laughs> Jigsaw put five people in his game. I put in three. You and I are the last two. Oh! I to see if I was as worthy as him. Talented. I would say you are, man. That's pretty fucking elaborate. Oh, okay. Where's Dr. Gordon in all this? Is he still out here secrets? Have mercy. Like you just had mercy on me? Yeah, you just tried to kill him. You tried to swing on him? Oh, yeah, you're you dead. Choice. Scream or don't. Oh, I like that. No. No, I'd kick him in the balls real quick. I created a game that appeared to be run by Jigsaw. I'll give you your hands. Follow my instructions exactly. Splice together the fucking audio. I'm not fucking dying. Fucking sniped him? <laughs> oh my god. Most cops do. It's a talent. 9 by 19 Parabellum. That's a Glock 17. The blood under the fingernails of our first victim. It's John Kramer's Oh my blood. god. This was elaborate as fuck. So you think it's Jigsaw. Eleanor will provide my alibi. 
Oh, Eleanor survived and not actually a killer? Okay. Jigsaw put the pieces of my life back together again. He gave my life purpose. We can never come from anger or from vengeance. You taught me that. Together, we built a legacy. He helped him build the reverse bear trap. It's ah. fucking laser his head. Oh my god. He just peeled like a fucking flower. And with the game over. Okay, so we gotta unpack this one just a little bit here. Another apprentice? Question <laughs> mark. Um, so Logan is actually the first apprentice. So that was his first game. So John's first game was in a barn. Love that. Didn't like how they were trying to thread the needle that Jigsaw was still alive. I guess it kind of makes sense that now that we have Logan's explanation that Logan was like, I wanted to see if I was as good as Jigsaw, if I could carry on the name. Because now this just opens up more questions for me where it's like, we're eight movies in and we're finding an apprentice that's, that's been here since before Saw 1. A fucking new age Billy with glowing eyes. How come Billy doesn't always have glowing eyes? I would be like, you know, this is what Billy is with the glowing eyes from now on. But I don't know. This movie just kind of uh, felt almost a little bit gimmicky. And I feel bad saying that. And I, I didn't hate this movie. I want to be clear with that. I think I would have enjoyed it more if it were specifically not trying to make you think Jigsaw is alive. And it went straight forward into the, it's another game. And, you know, maybe we think it's Dr. Gordon the whole time. Or even if they like played up that it was Hoffman. I would have preferred that they were like, no, nah, Hoffman's out here again. And kind of made it like tease that maybe Hoffman survived Dr. Gordon's game. I did like seeing Tobin Bell kind of, you know, classic first game. A little bit of prequel status there of like, this was what he was doing. Even from the first game, he was out here saying, your key to freedom was right here in the, in the shell. I could see why this one's kind of more controversial. A lot of people don't like this one based on comments. But there was a few of you guys that said I should definitely check it out. I am glad that I watched it just to say that, you know, we can get through the Saw Marathon. Let me know what you think of Jigsaw. Do you like Jigsaw the movie? Do you not like it? Do you kind of, you know, just avoid this one when you do your Saw Marathons? See you in the next one. We'll probably be watching Spiral soon and then we'll jump into a few other movies and we might have a, a new franchise to watch towards the end of November. So be on the lookout for some polls. But until the next time, guys, peace.